Chapter 3, Lesson 5, Percent of Change, Homework Assignment Examples. Number 2, 230 days to 69 days. Find the, the difference between the old and the new. 230 minus 69 is 161. If you go to the new, then you will go from the original. Therefore, 230 is the old or the original and 269 new days. Set up your equation 161 over 230 equals x over 100. When you cross multiply, you get 230 times x equals 161 times 100. 230 times x equals 116,100. Divide both sides by 230. And x equals 70%. Number 4, 50 minutes to 22 minutes. You take the old and the new and subtract the two. So 50 minus 22 equals 28. Put it over the original. Remember, you go to the new. Therefore, 50 is the original. Set it equal to x over 100. We can cross multiply. 50 times x equals 28 times 100. Solve your equation. 50 times x equals 2,800. Divide both sides by the coefficient and x equals Fifty-six percent. Number six. Take the old and the new and subtract the two. So I would take no, ninety minus forty-five will give me a difference of forty-five. Put it over the original, and remember, you go to the new. Therefore, forty-five is the original. Set it equal to x over 100. You cross multiply. So you get 45 times x equals 45 times 100. 45x equals 4,500. Divide both sides by 45. And x equals 100%. Number 7. Number eight, recent developments in a surgical procedure change the average healing time for some operations from 20 weeks to 12 weeks. Determine the percent of increase or decrease. This just means percent of change. And since we know the original is greater than the new, this is a decrease. You still take the old and the new and subtract the two. So we will do 20 minus 12, which equals a difference of 8. Take 8 over the original of 20. And remember, you always go to the new. Therefore, 20 is the original. That is equal to x over 100. We will cross multiply. 20 times x equals 8 times 100. 20 x equals 800, divide both sides by 20, x equals 40 percent. Number 10, last year the Backgammon Club had 30 members, this year the club has 24 members. Determine the percent of decrease in the number of members. They do tell us it is a decrease, 
Therefore, the old is greater than the new. 30 is greater than 24. But you still take the old and the new and subtract the two. So 30 minus 24 equals a difference of six members. Take the difference over the original of 30 members. That it equals the x over 100. We can cross multiply. 30 times x equals 6 times 100. 30 times x equals 600. Divide both sides by 30. Therefore, x equals 20%. Number 12. In 2016, 880 students voted in the student council election at San Bruno Middle School. In 2017, 748 students voted. What was the percentage change in the number of students that voted? Now remember, 2016 becomes before 2017. So this is the original, this is the new. We are going from 880 students, which is greater than 748. This will be a percent decrease. We still take the old and the new and subtract the two. It is a difference of 130 students over the original 880 students. Set it equal to x over 100. You cross multiply. You get 880 times x equals 132 times 100. 880x equals 13,200. Divide both sides by the coefficient of 880. And x will equal 15%. Number 14, Alicia planted 45 tulip bulbs last year. This year, she plans to plant 81 bulbs. Determine the percent of increase in the number of tulip bulbs. Because it is an increase, we know that the original is going to be less than the new. Therefore, 45 is less than 81. But you still take the old and the new and subtract the two. You have 81 minus 45. That is a difference of 36 tulip bulbs. Take the difference over the original of 45. Set it equal to x over 100. We will cross multiply. You get 45 times x equals 36 times 100. 45 times x equals 3,600. Divide both sides of the equation by the coefficient. Therefore, x equals 80%. Remember, to get credit for these seven work problems, you must show all the steps. Good luck, and I will see you tomorrow.